Welcome. In STAD Foundation Advanced 2024, you can now model, analyze, and design isolated and combined footings according to the ACI 318-19 specification. Similar to the design of mat foundations, the workflow for isolated and combined footings is as follows. You will start by modeling the appropriate foundations for each support. You will then perform the analysis and the post-analysis and finally, you will perform the design and detailing for each type of foundation. For this video, we will focus on the final step in the workflow for our isolated footings. To perform the design and detailing, we will specify and assign the design criteria, the detailing criteria, and the design envelope. Let's start with the design criteria. In the ribbon toolbar, Click on the Post Analysis Checks and Design tab and click on the Create Design Criteria icon. In the data area, enter a name for this criteria, specify that this criteria is appropriate for isolated footings, and select the ACI 318-19 specification. Once you are done, click on the Create button. Then, enter the appropriate code parameters and concrete and rebar information in the Design Criteria Properties dialog. Next, let's specify the detailing criteria for the isolated footings. In the ribbon toolbar, select the Post Analysis Checks and Design tab and click on the Create Detailing Criteria icon. In the Data area, enter the detailing criteria and click on the Create button. In the Detailing Criteria Properties dialog, enter the appropriate detailing preferences and spacing settings. Finally, let's create the design envelope. In the ribbon toolbar, select the Post Analysis Checks and Design tab and click on the Create Design Envelope icon. The detailing envelope is used to define the element type, analysis criteria, design criteria, and detailing criteria under a single moniker. It is also used to specify the design checks you wish to perform. For this example, we will perform a design check for each of the ultimate load combinations. The last step in this workflow before the design is performed is to assign the design envelope to the isolated footings. To do that, select the isolated footings and specify the design envelope in the Properties dialog in the Data area. We are now ready to design the isolated footings. In the main window, select the isolated footings. Then, click on the Isolated Footings tab in the ribbon toolbar and click on the Perform Design icon. After the design is performed, the design results can be viewed on screen. This completes the process for designing isolated footings using the finite element analysis method in STAD Foundation Advanced.